Hey guys, I'm back again with a 10S3P single belt drive cruiser build and today we're going to show you how to build that and I got some riding footage towards the end. It's a single mill to build and for me it's a board that I'll take to the shops or do any last mile commute with. The board is perfect for being a campus cruiser or in cities because of its small size and weight. I would suggest to build for anyone who's on a tighter budget or like me who wants a smaller build to go around with. Now onto the build. The part list is simple. The battery and the deck was taken from an onboard W2 Mini that I got as a prototype last year. The pulleys, truck and mount can all be found on our website. I'm using the Kegel Core 36 teeth pulley for the wheel and it gives a good balance between torque and speed. The wheels are the loaded Quagaramas, the 85mm and 77A. They're soft and a good size for cruiser build, but I would definitely go for something bigger if it was a longboard. The ESC is our ES controller based on the Fest 6 hardware. You can find it in the link in the description. It's affordable and convenient with a built-in switch and a remote so you don't have to buy it separately. I know that it's a single motor and a dual ESC is a complete overkill, but I figured why not as I could always upgrade the build with an extra motor later. The battery is a 10S3P Samsung 30Q pack, which would give enough amps and range for electric skateboards. The deck itself was a bit rough when I got it, so I decided to try final wrapping it. Some parts turned out quite good. I don't know if it's because of my skills, but the finish wasn't how I wanted it. If you have any suggestions, please let me know in the comments down below. Hey, if you like our video, please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. This video took me quite a long time to make, but I quite like it. So we'll be doing more videos in the future. So if you like it, please share it. And here we go. We'll do more. So yeah.
If you have watched it this far, thank you for watching. Please consider like and subscribing to the channel. If you have any questions, please comment below. I will try my best to answer them. I'm planning to do more videos with 360 footage as well. So stay tuned and until next time.